Hey, I was thinking about truth tables and um, how truth table is really just a lookup table for an argument. And so the way we've been making them, we can make them that way. There's another way we could go about making them too. So like if I had to make a truth table for this, I just have P and Q. So P and Q, and I'm going to get my true, true, false, false, true, false, true, false. So now I have my, this is like my combination every true and false combination for P and Q. And what we've done before is we've kind of built it up, you know, each piece at a time. But what I could do is I could just think about the whole argument in one fell swoop and then take each of these and run them through cases and then just write what they end up being here. So like what I mean is like P is true, Q is true. So I'll just plug that into here. Um, so for example, if I drew the true, true one, and I just plug them in. So P is true, so that'd be true and not true. Or not, whoop, P was true. Or not true. So notice I just plugged in true for P, true for Q, and I'm going to evaluate it. This would be true and false, or false. True and false is false, right? False and false is false. So this case is false. And then I could go through and just like do that for each of these cases. So in other words, now I could take P is true and Q is false. Just plug it in. P is true, not false. Q is false. Or not P. P is true. So true and not false. That'd be true and true. Or not true is false. True and true is true true or false is true. So this case would be true. And hopefully you get the idea, like I just go through and plug in false for P, true for Q, work it out, get my answer, false for P, false for Q, plug it in, get my answer, and then my truth table's made, and I don't have to do all those intermediate steps. So if you wanna build your truth table this way, go for it.